Hey, this is Dwight Blackman again. I'm going to try to show you how I made my jacks to lift a train engine, the miniature seven and a half inch trains. And I've been using this jack for a long time, but it was only used for below the track. So I made one that I could use above the track and in the track. So let me see if I can show you what I'm talking about. This is the one used below for like a maintenance stand and this one I developed to use above track so you if you had a trouble out on the track you could lift the engine let me show you how this works you close your valve and you start working on the jack and when you pull the engine up over those forks you can lift the engine like this and this is for the use down on in a work stand like this okay now if it's out on the track as you can see here I've got a piece of portable track that I'm using and uh, close your valve. Well, first you're gonna get this little, get this forks here. I got a, this is a, a piece of angle iron. So you run your engine up here to this and there's enough room in here for the coupler. So if you can get this under the car or if you can get this under the coupler, it will lift whatever you want to lift with it. So the other one is the same way. There's enough room in it for the coupler to go back into here, but you don't you don't need this for below the track because the engine is going to be sitting up here. So you only need this for whenever it's above the track. Okay, then you start lifting this will lift from the engine or the car whichever one you want to lift and as you can see the coupler has got enough room in here to come up with it this comes up this will lift it up high enough that you can get the trucks out from underneath it like that after you get it up, you can let it down with the. But another pro, another thing that I made on it is that these forks are adjustable. So if you need to see when you're going to lift it up, you can adjust your forks back and forth for your lifting plate here. So this one and this one is the same. You can use this one the same as you do this one and you can use this one the same as you do that one. All you have to do is to take these forks off and you can use it for above the track lifting the same as this here. So this is just an idea I had. I've already tried it out on my engines and it lifts them perfectly well. So if you want to try it, good luck.